welcome back to the channel of career zone students so in this video i will be telling you all the basic details related to the ielts listening and whenever you transfer your answers and you must note that how we should transfer our answers in the time span of 10 minutes so first of all as we all know that the first 30 minutes we listen to the audio and at the last 10 minutes we transfer our answers so basically our eyes listening is of the total 40 minutes but how you should transfer your answers let's begin with the details so i always prefer to write in the capital letters this is because Capital letters transformation is much more clear as well as the precise. So you should always transfer your answers in the capital letters. It, although it is not mandatory that you need to transfer the answers like these only, you can write in your normal handwriting also. But in order to like make it more clear to the examiner, we always prefer to let our students to write in the capital letters. Second one, you are able to see these numbers, right? So basically these are the numbers which are never seen in the computer or the mobile phone based language. We always see the numbers as like these ones. So you should keep in mind that whenever you transfer the answers, you should follow the computer language. You can also see in your computers as well as mobile phones like how the numbers are written and exactly you need to follow the pattern. My, my next tip is related to the zero. Whenever we listen to the eyes listening audio, they never speak zero. They always prefer to say O. Oh. So keep in mind that whenever they speak O, oh, it means zero. Next step is writing the time. You can see how I have written it, right? I have written this time with the double dots. But if we talk about the IELTS listening, the rule is that you need to transfer your answers of the time with the single dot. Okay, so let's move further. If we talk about the 15 lakh, which I have written on the board, means I have written it like 15 lakh. You can see that, but if we listen to the IELTS listening, then they prefer to say it 1.5 million or 1500,000. So you should keep in mind that they will not speak as like 15 lakh. Okay, so let's move to the further tip. My next step is whenever they speak the number like for example, this process lasts for the 3000 to the 4000 years. We have taken just example like so you just note that you will not write the answer 3 to 4000. You will create your answer like 3000 hyphen 4000. Okay, so let's move further. If we talk about the currency signs, dollars, pounds as well as the euros, you need you just need to remember that whenever these currency signs are given on the question sheet, you will not transfer these along with your particular number. For example, cost of the accommodation means per month is $450. Then if the dollar sign is given on the question sheet, you will not transfer on the answer sheet. You will directly transfer $450. For the last but not the least, no need to write the articles a and the whenever you transfer the answers of the as listening you should not write the articles along with the answers you might be thinking that like some of the answer starts with a vowel but you should write directly the answer not an article you will notice that the all the articles are given in the question sheet only so guys, these are the tips that you need to follow and keep it in your mind whenever you do the IELTS listening and whenever you transfer the answers. Thanks for watching and do subscribe our channel for the more such videos.